what we've been announcing today is the, the changes that will be made up till the end of November or till November 21st. Those changes will be quite important because they'll give businesses the ability to know that they have the wage subsidy for longer. And so for businesses like Tanya's business here, she'll have confidence that this wage subsidy will be around right through until that time period. So she knows that she has the ability to hire back people to make her business work even in a time of a particular challenge. So that extension and duration is important. Secondly, we know that it's also critical that we have the businesses able to continue to hire people even as they get into the restart. And we know that the requirement that businesses have a 30% reduction in revenue is not helpful in that regard. So what we're saying is that businesses will get the wage subsidy if they've had any reduction in revenue. So it's going to go all the way down to businesses that even have a small amount of revenue reduction, they'll get the subsidy as well. And it will be in proportion to the amount of their revenue reduction that they will get a subsidy. So it broadens the number of organizations, helps them to safely restart, to, to get their employees back at a time where their revenues are reduced. And third, we've, we've tailored the program, the program so that it helps those organizations that are particularly hard hit. So for organizations with over a 50% reduction in revenue over the last few months, they'll actually get a top up. They'll get up to 25% additional subsidy so that they can deal with this really challenging time for their businesses. What that means for businesses, those that were already in the program that have that 30% revenue decline, that'll continue to be the case for July and August. For those businesses, as I said, that are particularly hard hit, it will be even more. It'll go up to 85% wage subsidy or $960 per person. For those businesses that are less hard hit, but still hit, they'll be able to get into the program. The program will continue, but as we restart, the program will be tailored to help businesses appropriately in that restart. 